Good day, everyone. My name is Adibi Yotobi. Yeah, and welcome to this channel, Video Tutors. Now, this is a series, and this is the first part of the series on advanced mapping, which is a year three course for first semester in Rat students of the Department of Geosciences. Okay, our first map here is a topographical map, which we are going to turn into a geological map and also draw the cross section on it. Okay. Here we have a question. It said, the upper bedding plane of a limestone bed, 125 meter thick, outcrops at an altitude of what, 700 meter. It is succeeded above by brescia and below by the following beds. Okay. To understand the question, let me give you a sketch. Okay. The first bed that was mentioned is what limestone and they say is what 125 meter what thick okay so let's just say this limestone and it's what 125 meter what thick and it says an altitude you know when it's something an altitude it means that that is where the height is right so where it is found where that height is is at what seven dread okay that is where limestone starts from. Now, now say it is succeeded above by brescia. They didn't give a thickness of brescia. Okay? So, brescia, they'll say above this limestone, it is succeeded above, which means brescia is on top. And below by the following beds. So, below it, we have sandstone. That's the first one. And this sandstone is what? 100 meter thick. This sandstone. But first, let me take your mind back. They say that this is found at 700 meters. So the upper bedding plane of the limestone bed is at 700 meters. So what is the lower bedding plane if this is 125 meters thick? That will be what? 700 minus what? 120 what? 5. Which is what? 575. Five. So if I have 700 to what? 575. Five. That is where you can find what? Limestone. Now they say sandstone is what? 100 meter what? Thick. So at 100 meter, that's 575 to what? 475. So at this elevation, that is where you can find what? Sandstone. Then after that, we have shale, which is what? 125 meter thick. So here, say shale is like this. You know, they're talking about how we succeeded below it. 125. Sorry. We have shale, 125 meter thick. And it's 475 to what? 350. And I say the lowest bed is what mudstone. They didn't mention the thickness of it. So we also know that at 350 and below, the only rock that we can find here, what type of bed that we can find here is what mudstone. So here we have the elevation we are working with to draw our boundary on our what on our topological what map to convert it into what a geographical map. Sorry, I mean a geological map. So which means what we are working with from 700 to 575. We have limestone from 575 to 475. We have sandstone from 475 to 350. We have shale and, le and less than what? 350 meters. We have what? Mudstone. And above that, above 700, greater than 700, as we have here, you see that what? Is what? Bracia. We have Bracia. So, Journey with me as we convert this topological map to a geological map. Why do we say a geological map? In a geological map, we have legends on it, which means we have the, the bed on it, okay? And things that denote it. So let's start. Now, for you to draw the boundary, you can see these contours. Contour line shows what? Elevations, right? It shows elevations. You can see these contours. Now, we're going to draw each of them. So I'm going to start with Brescia. Let's start with this area. Okay? So Brescia is above 700, which means 700 this side, upward. So we have what? Brescia. This is the what? The symbol for what? For Brescia. Okay? The triangulars. So we now say that limestone is from what? 700 to 575. So now, if you want to draw your boundary, you can see that the next contour here is 600. But 575 is where 
in between 600 to what 500 so you are going to draw like you pick the shape of the contour of the highest bed so between 500 and 600 575 if you want to draw the contour it must follow the shape of what of 600 so 575 the one that is near can you see I'm not following it with 500. I'm drawing it because it's closer to what? To 600 contour. Okay. Sharp. Oh, sorry. You can see, normally, if I'm following 500 now, I will have entered here. But no, because I'm following the what? The upper boundary. So, I will upper contour. So, I will just continue with what? With 600. Good. The next, we have from... This is 575. The next, we have from... For sandstone, which is 575 to 475. So 475, the higher one is what? 500. So I'm going to follow the shape of what? Of 475. Shape of what? 500. 475. Sharp. You've drawn your what? 475. The next, from 475 to 350, that is what? Shield. Okay? Now, 350 is found between 300 and what? And 400 what? Contour right okay so you are going to you're not going to you know that i tell you that is the upper contour anyone anywhere the boundary is found is the upper contour shape you're going to follow so instead of following the way 300 is just smaller if you follow what the way 400 is that's for 350. can you see that okay you are following how 350 looks like so now we've drawn our our boundary then our boundary okay now we are not going to follow the shape we are going to follow the shape. We have the land, we have the limestone. Now, the limestone, you know the shape of limestone is like brick. Something like this. Okay? So, you are going to continue with this. You continue with this. So, for limestone, I'm supposed to use my ruler, but just let's make the video short. We have this. We have this. Okay. Yeah. Okay, you draw it for your legend to there. A symbol on it. Like that, like that. The next you're going to draw what? For sandstone. You do for sandstone. Sandstone is just a smaller dot, you know, sand. Smaller dot that's easy to denote it. Then after that, we have our what our shale. Shale is the next. Okay. So shale is just a straight line. Okay. Just a straight line. So next, after that, is our what? Our mudstone. So mudstone is just an empty. Line. That means there's no any, um, just white, just pure white. Okay. So we've come to the end of this session. This is just the normal basic mapping. So we are in the next playlist, we are going to do the advanced geological map where we are talking about dipping. Thank you.